Hey guys, it's Leah here, back again with another video. Okay, so as you guys can see, I'm in a totally different area here because we are doing a different type of video today. Um, so since Molly, Courtney, and I are separated again, so we are definitely still doing a Q&A, but we're also going to do this little extra video for you guys um, just to change it up a little bit because Q&As could become a little boring after a while if you just keep on doing them. So Courtney thought of this idea, she saw other YouTubers do it, and I'll link it in the description. Um, Hannah Maloche did it, like, one of my fave YouTubers, um, so check out her video if you haven't seen it. You probably already have, I don't know why I'm shouting her out, like, she needs a shout out. Um, <laughs> uh, Courtney on our Instagram made a post uh, asking, like, our followers to make a to make assumptions about us, um, and then we would answer them in say if they're true or not. So yeah, I'm going to read them and then Molly's gonna read them and Courtney's gonna read them and then I'm gonna mash all our answers together and you'll see all our varying perspectives on all these answers. So enjoy this video, you guys. This is gonna be crazy. Hello. Hi guys, it's Leah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi. 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 Hello, it's Molly from Leo Fiori. <laughs> Today I'm going to be answering assumptions you guys have about us because we hit 10,000 and that's like actually a pretty big deal so we're going to try and do more on the channel. So today we're filming the like assumptions video. So before we get started I wanted to talk briefly about our attire. No, no, we went to the mall today and I found it first and I was like I really like that and then he found it and he's like I really like it. And they're two for 25 so we got them and then we came back and he's like we're both wearing them. So now we match. I don't particularly like it. <laughs> okay, so now we'll get into the video. So the first first assumption is that Leah is the brains, Courtney's the brawn, and Molly is the crazy. I'm gonna have to go with a yes on that one. That's good. <laughs> that's um. <laughs> well, you know what? That's pretty spot on. <laughs> I'm kidding, but no, Courtney is actually like freakishly strong. Um, you never want Courtney to punch you. Here's a little flashback of Courtney punching Molly. Yeah, that was scary. Um, so don't get Courtney angry is basically the the little advice I have for you today. And Molly is crazy. Like she's literally the wild card. She's psycho. Um, brains. I'm the brains. I don't know. I am kind of manipulative I'm kind of like clever in some ways but but I don't I don't I don't like I'm not I don't know if I'm the brains I don't know I mean let's see what Courtney and Molly say about that yeah no I, that's actually fair I don't know Leah enough to call her like the brains the brains but you know she's kind of got like the whole YouTube thing down so I think that's accurate um but I think um I was gonna say we're all crazy but I don't think Leah's no, I don't think Leah's crazy at all. I can't be. Yeah, oh, I know. So please, you're getting in trouble for being a laptop. Fine. <laughs> Leo, since you own me now, I'll get off my laptop. Okay, number two. That you guys are around 19 or 20 and live on the East Coast. Ooh, this is getting specific. Well, I don't know if we should say this. I'm definitely not going to say our location. I'm not going to answer that one. Me and Courtney, I'll tell you this, me and Courtney are one year older than Molly. And we are sophomores in college, and Molly is a little itty bitty freshman. Y'all be popular and have nice families, etc. Nah, they win. They're not popular. Well, I mean, Leah and Molly are, but not Courtney. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that ain't true. Yeah, that ain't it, <laughs> sis. Um... Why do you want me in this video again? I don't know, it's <laughs> annoying me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wouldn't say... In high school, I definitely wasn't. College popularity, I feel like, isn't really a thing. Like, I have a ton of friends here, and I know a lot of people, but I wouldn't. Right? I feel like popularity... Oh, uh, yeah. So, there's an answer for that. And yes, I feel like we all have nice families. I just want to be in it. <laughs> I just want to be famous. I want 10,000 people to know my name and life. Uh, Courtney sucks at math. Don't ask me why I think that. I just got a feeling. <laughs> I don't know. I Courtney's pretty smart. I don't know, guys. Courtney's actually okay at math. But she just kind of sucks at school in general, but like she does, she works really hard. 
but she's a good she's a good egg. You are correct. Um, I'm very very bad at math. I've kind of always been not like horrible, but pretty bad in comparison to him too. He was a math team captain in high school, so he's a bad <laughs> Courtney is the sane, hyperactive friend who you can be grateful for or want them to shut up. Courtney, no, that's normally me. No, that's not true at all. Courtney's one of the chillest, like, persons I know. Maybe they're mistaking Courtney for Molly. <laughs> so, when we got this one submitted, Leah sent it to, like, the group chat that she has with Molly and I. And she's like, that's not true about you at all. And she's like, I think it's about Molly, which that makes more sense. Okay. I hope it isn't true, but my assumption is that Courtney and Molly are secretly already caught up with The Walking Dead. Wow, okay. No, they're not caught up. Why would we do this channel at all if they already watched the show? I feel like that's just a total waste of time. No, they haven't seen any of it. No, we actually love watching it all together, and it's super fun. Dead. False. Fate said, I assume that all of you just started college. All three of you guys. Um, Molly's a freshman, Lee and I are both sophomores. So that's like kind of correct. As I said before, me and Courtney are sophomores. Molly is a freshman. She just started college. She's just starting her second semester. So there you go. Um, I have an assumption that Molly plays volleyball. I don't know why. She just looks like a volleyball player. Um, no, I'm not a volleyball player. You guys know we all met at ballet and we all did ballet together for a really long time, but never done any other sports or physical activities. My assumption for each girl. Oh, this is weird. This one's sent in by a guy named Ethan. It's not like it could be Courtney's boyfriend or anything. My assumption for each girl, Molly's demonic or satanic. <laughs> Spot on. No, I'm kidding. Molly, <laughs> I'm just not going to answer that. So my assumptions for each girl. One, Molly's demonic. I mean, maybe. Sometimes, yeah. I think Courtney has a boyfriend. I don't know. You are correct. And number three, Leah doesn't actually like Courtney and Molly, but she understands their importance to the channel and the channel growth, so she's secretly using them in order to gain more viewers and increase her ad revenue, which she keeps for herself <laughs> until she earns enough money where she doesn't need Molly and Courtney anymore, and at that point we'll kick them to the curb. <laughs> I think it's true. We'll see what Leah says. But I mean, yeah. I think once she gets big enough and doesn't need us, we'll be gone. Damn. I agree with that assumption. Honestly, wouldn't put it past her. <laughs> oh my god. That's so stupid. Ethan! Ethan, you're ridiculous. That's not true. Um, Matt says, I feel like Molly's the kind of person who has a mental breakdown while going through a haunted attraction, and Leah is the one who has to drag her through it and tell her to get her shit together. 100% correct. <laughs> no. Uh, yes, I will have a mental breakdown, but Leo will be right there next to me having it with me. That is spot on. I mean, me and Molly haven't really been in a haunted house before together, um, but I feel like if we were in that situation, that's exactly how it would go. Molly is very temperamental, and I'm usually trying to keep calm, but sometimes I do end up freaking out. I kind of have a bad temper sometimes, but usually I try to like keep my shit together. Molly will talk her ear off. Yes. Courtney slaps Molly to prevent her from talking someone's ear off. Yes. Leah plans the get-togethers. Yes. <laughs> yeah. That's a great job. I mean, maybe. Uh, Courtney slaps Molly to prevent her from talking someone's ear off. <laughs> yeah, I guess, yeah. And Leah plans the get-togethers. Yes, I do. Um... I usually am the one that tries to get all of us together. Courtney helps me a lot though. Molly just has no sense of planning or thinking ahead. <laughs> Very caring and great people with awesome sense of humor. My heart. <laughs> Thank you, that's so nice. Um, we try. <laughs> I think that Molly and Leah are definitely that's correct. Yeah. My assumption is that Molly secretly cried when she saw Santa at the mall because it looked like Herschel. I did too. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. I feel like that's something she might do. Um, yeah, so we'll have to look at her answer to that. Stop. Herschel, I'm still really sad about Herschel, especially since the actor actually died a while ago. 
my heart. Uh, but an actual assumption is that you three will be successful, but in different fields. Oh, that's so nice. And true that we are interested in different fields. Um, Courtney's really interested in all occupational therapy and that type of thing. Uh, Molly's, Molly's really interested in theater, and I'm interested in, like, you know, film editing. Just the whole process of, like making TV shows and movies, like that's something that I've always dreamed of, of getting a job with that, like, you know, producing things, um, filming things. So yeah, that's kind of it. Yes, actually, um, I don't know what I want to do. I'm studying to be a teacher, but Courtney's occupational therapy track. Um, Leah is on communications track, so she'll be in the business field, and then I'll be a teacher. So we're all going very different ways. You guys are chill and enjoy making YouTube videos because I know that I enjoy watching them. On it. Yeah. Thank you. What do you think? They're gonna quit the group actually. No, we're not. Oh, that's cute that you enjoy watching them. Honestly, don't know how the channel lasted this long slash grew. Um, it started off because we never do anything nice for Leah and we used to bully her, so we were like, let's do one nice thing and now like this is like something we actually do a lot. Thank you for watch watching them. Um, I mean, we're kind of chill and I do enjoy we do enjoy making YouTube videos. Um Molly, Courtney do have short attention spans, but they do, I think they do like filming with me. And I think they love, like you guys, they love all our subscribers and everything. Molly makes me laugh so hard at her reaction to The Walking Dead, especially when Dale died, RIP. Yes, that episode was so iconic. Um, oh my god. I just, I, I, it could have not, it couldn't have gone better. Like, it was so funny. Me and Courtney were dying. Um, it was very similar to uh, the season finale of season one, which Molly also freaked out. Those two are my favorite episodes that we've ever filmed. It was just the funniest thing. I never expected her to act that way about Dale, but if you haven't seen those videos, the link are in the description. Check them out. It's one of the funniest things I've ever seen. The, and I like when she slaps money, Molly, because it's so unexpected. Honestly, that shit hurted. Um, please don't hit me, Courtney. Courtney is funny as well, and I like when she slaps Molly because it's so unexpected. <laughs> she is awesome. Exclamation point. Leah, you are amazing. You are a good editor and a real reactor. It is so funny when you get confused with some information on The Walking Dead. Ha ha ha. There's a laughing emoji. <laughs> it can get difficult when uploading. I get that. I get so excited when a new video is up. My overall opinion is you are all good and wonderful in your own ways. Also, once you're done with The Walking Dead, get my brain to react to The 100 if they haven't already watched it. Alright, The 100 actually is kind of a bang, I'm not gonna lie. Um. Leah, you're amazing. Okay, I don't want to react to this because it's not about me. Um, Leah's really not a good friend. <laughs> I like that Leah's going to be watching all of this. Um, you guys are all good and wonderful in your own ways. That is true. We're like the three musketeers. Our group chat's called the three musketeers. Leah won't put that in. Leah doesn't let me say anything. Like, now that I'm, like, trying to censor myself instead of having her censor me, Leah doesn't let me say shit. But, um... Our group chat's called the Three Musketeers because, like, we're the Three Musketeers. And they said when we're done with the 100, when, when we're done with the Walking Dead, react to 100. I actually, I've watched the first episode of the 100, and I liked it a lot. And I know that Leah watches it, but I know Courtney doesn't. But I think Ethan does. Um, Courtney is funny as well, and I like when she slaps Molly because it's so unexpected. <laughs> yeah, me too. Uh, she is awesome. Uh, Leah, you are amazing. You're a good editor and a real reactor. It's so funny when you get confused with some information on The Walking Dead. Yeah, I, I do end up getting confused just because, like, I haven't seen these episodes in forever. And I sometimes don't even re remember certain episodes. There's going to be an episode coming up that me and Courtney watched of The Walking Dead. And I, like, totally forgot. Uh, Leah, you are nice to everyone. Oh, my God, that's so nice. Um, thank you. <laughs> this is great. I love these assumptions. Incorrect. That was very true. Leah's super, super sweet. Her house, her family's great. Yeah, mm -hmm. actually, I was like gonna like make fun of you, like, oh my god, like, you know, Leah's so sweet of it. But like, she's right, like, and her family's so yeah, nice. Yeah, they're awesome. Um, I assume you guys hate us since you're lacking with the Walking Dead videos. Okay, so here's what's happening. We are literally filming in three different states and a million different places at all times. We want to film as much as we can, but we're also all at school. So, it's not that we don't like you guys, it's not that we're slacking, it's that we literally are not together, and we film all the time on breaks, so we hang out every day. So, just cut, cut Leah some slack, because she tries her hardest, and you can also watch her other videos, and you can also subscribe to After Hours, because that's super fun. 
Okay, I assume that Leah is the one who keeps Courtney and Molly together for a video while then while they both mess around. Correct, 100% correct. I think I still have a video of, this was like a way while back, and Molly and Courtney were like pissing me off because they were looking, their phone, looking up like a minor spoiler on their phones that I shouldn't have got angry about, but I got like really annoyed. Um, I think I still have the video, so here it is if I still have it. Um, but yeah, they were, I forget what they were looking up. It was something minor. It wasn't a big spoiler, but I just want them to have like a very fresh mind when they watch The Walking Dead. I don't want them to really know anything about what's going to happen. I feel like that's just the more pure reaction that you guys should get. Um, but they're like little deviants. Like I can't handle it sometimes. Usually they're pretty good at that. They usually don't want to know big spoilers or anything but once in a while they'll like they'll like want to know this certain thing and I'm like listen it'll be explained to you in like an episode and they're like no I gotta see it now it's so annoying correct um Molly and I definitely just kind of go crazy sometimes and Leah's more focused but I feel like over the years Leah has become more crazy with us and she lets us mess around more that is true it used to be me and Leah it used to be me and Courtney against Leah and then Courtney went off to school and Leah kind of stayed closer to home So I got really alone because Leah would fight me like normally it was two against one and now it's Just me and Leah just beating each other up Stella said you guys are my favorite reaction channel You guys inspire me and every time I feel depressed. I watch you guys. I love you with all my heart You're one of my inspirations. I'm so thankful to find a channel channel I don't know if that's what an assumption, but I don't know what it means, but I just want to say I love you guys that's really cute. Stella, I love you too. Thank you so much, Stella. That, like, is one of the kindest things I've ever received. Like, thank you. I love you guys with all of my heart. You guys are one of my big inspirations. I am so thankful to find the channel with three heart emojis. If that isn't what assumption means, I'm sorry. I don't know what that means. <laughs> that's okay. That's, <laughs> that's alright. That was really sweet, and thank you. We, like, appreciate, like, all of that so much. So thank you. I thought Molly was weird for the longest time, and I assumed there was something wrong with her head. But it grew on me, lol. <laughs> I mean, you're not, like, wrong. It did grow on you, though. <laughs> yeah, no, that's fair. Molly's insane. I feel like I've said that a million times in this video, but she's actually crazy. Uh, but in the best way possible. Exactly. Spot on. Spot on. Um, a fun fact for you guys. Me and Molly were actually enemies before we became friends. <laughs> um... We just are total polar opposites in our personalities and like behavior. So we were kind of like low key enemies. Um, but then we became friends because we both realized that we're like really ridiculous and funny. Um, um, and I think that's because I just realized how funny Molly is. Like she's probably uh, one of the funniest people I ever met in my life. She's absolutely hilarious. And although we are totally different, um, it's just, I think we get along pretty well, most of the time. <laughs> Leah is scared of spiders. Molly has a lot of bald patches. Okay, I don't, oh, wait, this is like an important, okay, I know you guys think I'm bald, but I'm not bald. Like, look, this is a full head of hair. I don't, like, yes, you guys see me, like, scratching my head sometimes. It's something I do when I'm bored, but I'm not bald. Uh, Leah is scared of spiders. Molly has lots of bald patches. <laughs> it says bald patches. I know. <laughs> So, I'm- I like bold patches better. <laughs> what are bold patches? She's just brazen. Is that the correct word? I don't know. Like, bold all the time. Oh. Like, <laughs> just randomly bold. Just randomly like, oh, I'm gonna go do something. <laughs> nah. Um, I'm gonna go save a kid. <laughs> Be bold. I don't know if Leah's afraid of spiders. I want to say she is. I can see her being afraid of spiders. Um, Who isn't? That's true. Um, Molly... has lots of bold patches. If it's bold patches, I will say yes to that, because there are times where she's just like, I'm just gonna go do something crazy, and she definitely does that. If it's bold patches, that is true as well. Leah is scared of spiders. Molly has a lot of bald patches. <laughs> I think there was like a running joke for a while on our channel that Molly kept wearing a hat because she had a bald spot on her head. <laughs> 
That was so funny. Um, no, she doesn't have any bald patches on her head. And as for spiders, yes. Spiders and like overall bugs are like a big fear of mine. Ugh. I'm like a little bit of a germaphobe, so it just grosses me out. Okay, this person said, Molly likes old men. <laughs> um, yes. That Molly likes old men. She does. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> said, Molly likes old men. It's Dale. He's like the best. I, there, there's nothing to compare to him. He's like, but I don't like, I don't want to f Dale. Leah, bleep that out. Like, I don't, I'm not like attracted to Dale. He's just like my little grandpa best friend. Um, I assume you guys have all known each other for a long time since you were little kids. Actually, we didn't. We met when Leah, I met Leah when I was in fifth grade. And I met Courtney when I was a freshman in high school. And because we all did ballet together, but Courtney came to our ballet studio later on. We met... I think sophomore. That's actually false. Good assumption though. Um, if we have known each other for a while since I think sophomore year of high school, but we haven't known each other all our lives. Um, and that's mostly because we went to different schools. We met at ballet where we do where we did ballet together. And I assume you guys literally never fight. <laughs> are you kidding? Of course we fight. What are we? What do you think this is? Um, no, we fight, not constantly, but we do fight once in a while. We don't fight about, like, little petty stuff. Um, we are, I would say, definitely, like, sisters. They could disagree with me, but I think we are. Um. No, I was laughing at Oh, uh, I'm laughing at me. I don't even know what you said. I was Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so we, we don't fight about little things. We do have disagreements sometimes about big stuff. Like, if Molly and I have plans, I feel like Molly will explain this. But though we, Molly's very, very bad with like scheduling things and showing up when she says she will. So we get into fights about that sometimes. Um, other than that, though, we're, we're usually pretty good. So this is incorrect. We get in scuffles a lot. And it's normally between me and Leah and then Courtney has to break them up. Or it's between me and Courtney and Leah has to break them up. Me and Courtney actually rarely fight. We, Me and Courtney f like kind of bicker about when she forced me to go to ballet. Uh, I really didn't want to go to ballet class and she always forced me to go and that was kind of like a little bit of a, a mini fight <laughs> once in a while. But usually we get along really well. Molly, <laughs> on the other hand, we tend to get into more fights with. I don't know why, um, but it just tends to, ends up happening. But Courtney and Molly actually got into a fight like a week ago and I had to. we had to literally go on FaceTime um, and I had to like mediate the whole entire fight. It was insane, but they are fine now. And Courtney and Maddie. Okay, rude. My name is Molly. Um, we're more popular ones and Leah wasn't as much. <laughs> Leah, I'm sure you're popular in your own way, bitch. Um, Courtney went to a very, very private school and I know she spent a lot of time at ballet. I was not popular. You guys have seen me on the channel. I was weird as shit. Um, Leah was really quiet. But she went to also like a very, very small school, so they all had like their own group of friends. But I went to public school. I don't think any of us were really popular in high school. Leah definitely is more reserved and kept herself. She has her friends, but she likes to stay home, chill with her family more. And Courtney and Maddie, I think, not Maddie, Molly, and you call yourself a fan, but were the more popular ones, I think. And Leah probably wasn't as much. No offense, Leah. I'm sure you're popular in your own way, bitch. <laughs> don't know okay no we're not popular we're not like we're in college now popularity has really no factor anymore so that is that hopefully that answers some of your assumptions um yeah okay bye peace out guys see you in the next episode of leah fireflies reacts thank you guys so much for always supporting this channel i know i say this all the time but like I like can't appreciate it enough like you guys are literally the best um, and I hope you guys enjoyed this little video um, if you want us to do more videos like this once in a while let us know in the comments or like let us know if you like this type of stuff um, because we actually really enjoy doing it it's a nice change of pace from our usual reaction um, like setup that we usually do and it's cool to do videos it's cool to still have videos up on the channel even when Molly and Courtney are away we could still film on our own and then put it together um so yeah thank you so much thank you to courtney for um suggesting this this, is, this was a really good idea and 
really funny. Uh, so thanks, Courtney. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. We have a lot of Walking Dead filmed for when we were on winter break, so please stay tuned for that. Um, and yeah, thank you guys so much. I hope you all have a fantastic day. Love you guys. Okay, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Get the Patreon up, and there's so much like shit on the Patreon. You guys saw the channel trailer. It's so funny. And you just get to see like more of look like that isn't The Walking Dead. And we'll be posting this soon, and we'll be home soon for break, so you will get more Walking Dead videos. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram. Our Instagrams are down below. And yeah. See you next video.